Hi Shoebox friends, this is Denise from D. Rogers. Welcome back to my channel for another unboxing for a boy five to nine for Operation Christmas Child. Today's unboxing is a special box that I packed, I think in late February or early March. I do remember it being a little bit difficult to pack, so um, I hope I can repack it. But let's take a look at it. When this little boy sees his box on the outside, he will see minions. And on the top, there is a minion valentine. And there's a little bit of glare from my window, but I hope that that will be okay. And when he opens it up, he will, well, he will see this on top, which doesn't look like much until I take it off. So let's take that off. And once I take that off, that's what he will see. And the lining of the box is actually, um, it's a placemat that you can get at the Dollar Tree. And I just cut them to use as the lining to hide the contents of his box. So right on top, he has a scarf. This is actually a minion scarf that I got from Walmart on clearance. Um, there's actually, I think, a hat. I don't know if I was able to get the hat in or not, but let's see when we go a little bit further. I packed this so long ago, I don't remember everything I packed. So that was his scarf. And then right on top, tightly sitting in there, is this cute little minion stuffy. And he's really a nice one because he's got a lot of beans in him. Okay, he has, let's pull this out. I think it will just be easier. This is his composition book. And in his composition book, I stuck some stickers. These are some sports stickers. And this is a wide ruled composition book. And then right on top, he has his soccer ball, which was really cool because I was able to find a soccer ball that was black and yellow which matched the minions. So I thought that was great. I think this is a size five soccer ball. And then inside he has his pump. And I actually on the needle, I put a, um, a gripper, like a child's pencil gripper to protect the needle. So that's a soccer ball. He also has one of these little um, carabiner flashlights that you can get from Harbor Freight. So those are pretty nice. It has different modes. He has um, some soap and a little soap saver with some band-aids. And I get the soap savers on Amazon. He has a little soccer egg that I got at Easter time. I don't remember what's in here, so let's take a look. Ah, okay, so inside he has an extra needle for his pump and he has some pencil caps and he has a minion eraser. It's actually an eraser cap for a pencil. That was a fun little surprise. Okay, you have some crayons, some crazy art 24 pack. He has a coloring book in the back. This is called Champion Coloring Book. It's like a sports coloring book. It has action figures in it too, so it's pretty pretty well-rounded coloring book for a little boy. I think I got this at the Dollar Tree. All right, all of his school supplies were sitting loosely in here, so I'm, that must have been the only way I could have packed them. So he has some Ticonderoga, he has some Minion pencils, I think those were from Valentine's Day. He has this pretty cool sparkly star pencil. He has a black pen, a blue pen, a red pen. He has this gel pen, a scented gel pen from, I think I got it from Dollar Tree. And a highlighter, a yellow highlighter. And again, I tried to go with like the Minion theme colors. So I think he's pretty good on school supplies. He has some scissors. He has a whistle on a, like a string lanyard. And I think I got these from Amazon earlier this year. 
He has a glue stick. He has, oh, this is cool. This is a yellow and blue Hot Wheels car to match the minion colors. He has a little minion figurine. I think that was like a blind bag from somewhere. Oh, he's gonna fall. Okay, there we go. <laughs> he has two pencil sharpeners, a yellow and a blue one. Another minion pencil cap. I don't know where I got those from, but they're really cute. A blue eraser, a blue cross on a, like a lanyard string. I got those from Oriental Trading. Here's his pencil pouch laying flat in his box. He has a yellow t-shirt, and this is a size youth, uh, youth medium. And I don't remember where I got it from. It looks like maybe I might've gotten it from the Dollar Tree. But it's a really nice color yellow to go with his minion theme. And actually it matches like the soccer ball. And it's short sleeve. Oh, there's his hat. Okay, so on the bottom, underneath the shirt, he has his minion hat, which I thought was really cute. And I got this whole set at Walmart on clearance. I think the whole set was $3, um, but it's been a while since I bought it. He has a pair of gloves with the minions on it. And then underneath that, he has two pairs of socks. And those were from Walmart. He has another blue and yellow car. Oh, this one's pretty neat looking too matches the colors. So here's his two Hot Wheels. He has a yellow fidget spinner. He has a yellow uh, eraser to match his blue one. He has a pair of nail clippers that probably fell out of his um, soap saver bag. He has a blue toothbrush. Uh, he has a set of Legos. These are, it's a blue set. And actually, I wonder if I cut out anything to show what it makes. Oh, I think this is one of those classic sets that you get from Walmart. I included this in the packaging to show what he can make with it. So it has all these different options. A car and a robot. So there's like three things he can make with it. So that's a nice little set for him and that fit very nicely and flat in the bottom of the box. And I think I got that on clearance at Walmart, but I don't remember the price. He has a little minion notebook, a little mini journal. And on the very bottom, oh, he still has more things. He has a blue washcloth. He has a yellow comb. He has a little stencil and a ruler. And he has a yellow bandana. Lots of yellows and blues. And on the very bottom, he has some of those stickers. I think these were from the Dollar Tree from that strip that you can get of minions. So those are really fun. They're really big. And then just stuck on the bottom, kind of random, was this little zebra. I must have had that tucked in somewhere for a surprise. And I think I got everything. Oh, here's his letter. I used one of the standard OCC forms that says let's be friends with our picture, our Bible verse, where we're from. And I think we are good to go. So that is his minion box for a boy, five to nine. I think it's one of my favorites this year. I've done a couple minion boxes in the past. They're always fun to do and um, they're just always so bright and cheery. So thank you for watching. Um, please comment below and I always enjoy reading your comments and be sure to like and subscribe. 
So thank you for watching. You have a blessed day and I'll see you in my next unboxing. Bye-bye.